That's farmer friend singer songwriter Lyle Strickland. And that's farmer friend and jack of all trades Chris Horn. And we're Those, Those Taste, Taste Bud Guys. guys. Welcome back. Thanks for joining us one more time, all you wonderful internet peoples. We have a guest with us today, and he brought presents. He what did. Else? Not really. A few. I mean, it's his present, but then, you know. He's so generous. He's sharing his Christmas present with us. <laughs> but we do have other presents, too, that was given to us. We do. Uh, from Cinder Block Brewing uh, out of Kansas City. Yeah. Have you had Cinder Block before? I have not had Cinder Block at all. I have, but it's been a while. I'm looking forward to it. Jeremy? Yeah, I've never. It's I've, I've had a few KC brews, and uh, this is one of the brews I have not drank. Same so with me. So, our guest today is Jeremy Evans, and he is a musician. Yeah. But a local musician, and more than that, he's one of our friends. He knows a lot about beer, so much so that he brought his Christmas present with us. Absolutely. Oh my gosh. I'm Which, so excited to share it, too. I don't know how much time we need to set this up, but I'm, I'm going to let you set that up and do your it's, thing. It's I pretty easy. It to the bottom it's all right. Again. It's That falls off every once in a while. So there we go. you can do the, the setup on it, and we'll, do. we'll talk about what it is, I guess. Absolutely. So it's pretty easy. Uh, this is called a physics. Uh, what these are, it's a, your own personal tap. Um, when I saw this... On YouTube, they did a Shark Tank about it, and uh, Shark Tank is a show that if you're an entrepreneur, you present an item, and uh, they present different ideas oh, on Shark Tank. Size. I told you. I, I was watching that the other day, and the, the whole Shark Tank thing is super cool idea. I, I enjoy watching that show, and this is one of the things that I got really excited about when I saw it, and uh, I was presented with it for Christmas. It's a great Christmas present. Super easy to use. There's a little button right here. I just take the top off. If you look inside, there's just a little straw in there. Uh, this basically does not use any like there's nitrogen, no CO2, no, CO2, no nothing. Okay. There's batteries up in the top. It takes four of them. They're all in the top. And all I do is I just uh, so put a little adding pan. anything to you're the not, You're not adding anything. You had nothing. I so mean, I got this random Snapchat about how great this thing was, and you got to try it, and I'm like, well, bring it up here. <laughs> and so he did, and now we're all like, oh, <laughs> yeah. what do we do with this thing? It's real interesting, and it's so, super easy to use. Here's what we did. We got two cans, the exact same beer, the wit from uh, Cinder Block Ring, and we're going to put one can through it, and we're going to put one can in the glass. Like Sound good? Glass? Yeah. glass? All right. Why you do the, uh, yeah. Why you do the hookup thing? The physics Pretty easy. stuff. <laughs> All right. Uh, this is Cinderblock's Weathered Wit. So. That's some, that was well, that's, riveting. That's actually very pretty. I'm sorry. I was staring at how pretty I know that we, beer is when it poured we out. We was all right? kind of like, dang, Law, you, you <laughs> got one right. <laughs> it looks good. Very it's pretty. Nice it really does. The foam's nice and tight on it. Absolutely. All right. There's even a right. good little bit of microfoam in there. That's going to look good coming out of here, too. So we're going to line that up. You basically just shove it down in there, and you're ready to go. So you don't have to pour it or nothing? Not it's at good. all. You always want to do a 45 degree. Any tap I'm system, gonna it doesn't matter. For a minute and good deal. I'm going to zoom in. So 45 degree angle, we're going to push it forward. It's just distributing. Okay. That's what it does. Distribute the beer. Now, it'll stop itself. So watch it stop itself. And I'll tell you the reason why when it does it. Okay. So now stop. it's stopped it itself. Yep. So if you're a microfoam person and you just love microfoam out of your taps, uh -huh. you can then push this backward and it adds the microfoam. Whoa! So there you go. And now we've poured a beer just like Lyle's with smoother foam on top. Oh, oh, my God. <laughs> oh my god. Anybody else is mind blown like mine is? So I agree, there's not much difference in the nose. There's almost an orange peel on the nose, but there's like a butterscotch in the flavor. It's the, uh, let's get that close for that thing right here. You know, a lot of wits that I, I get, I don't I get a, a bigger banana flavor than this one than I do, do in most of them. Uh, a lot of them I get big citrus. Banana peel maybe, but I don't get the mm -hmm. yeah. So this is out of the can. Right? That's out of the can, yeah. Me that phone. Right. That's still sticking around. That is insane. Let's yeah. see if that tastes any different. So the, the big takeaway I get on it is the one out of the can tastes. Mm. If you can describe one it's as tasting rockier, thing. grittier, yeah, yeah, bigger, mm -hmm. and the other one's smoother, oh. more refined. Yeah. So I guess whichever one you 
personally like. I just flattered. But the good. flavors, flavors spot on. I mean, yeah. it's right there. I'm well, actually shocked. Both. I think the um, benefit to this gadget right here is it does seem to smooth out the, the beer a little bit in that foam as you can see, is still sticking around. Yeah, you can absolutely tell the difference. That's insane. I probably set it right behind the camp, like microphone and stood that way. I mean, that's, that's nuts. <laughs> it is. It's crazy. The the physics, to me, um, this revolutionizes uh, your home game as yeah. far as drinking beer. Yeah, yeah. So if you're like one of those people that just, you know, I don't really want to go out. It's COVID season, you know. If you guys out there, you know, since it is the COVID thing, I mean, you don't want to be out in crowds a lot, and this is a good way to just kind of stay at home and drink what's in your fridge. So that one's brighter, and I call it hit your tongue. It's more fizzier and gets in your tongue mm -hmm. faster, and this one, uh, like I said, it's kind of more relaxed. But it's really, I mean, I really like the way, I think you're spot on. It actually tastes like South Pat. Yeah. 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 Uh, I'm not a huge fan of wits in general, but I like them too. That's this pretty good is for lighter beer. beer. I, so, yeah. yeah, let's talk about that for just a second. This thing is awesome. Um, did it improve the beer? It wasn't much needed to improve to be not much to improve on. Yeah. It's yeah. really a good beer, I think. But yeah, if you like that brighter, fizzier, mm -hmm. then this thing will do it. If you're around Kansas City, go check out Cinder Block Brewing. Uh, yeah, if you're just at home and you want a good uh, bar experience, wait, what's this thing? Experience. What's this thing called? Physics. Uh, physics uh, way tap system. Way tap. Okay. So right. check out the. Shh, 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 shh. What? Alexa, add physics way tap to my grocery list. You guys will thank me later. <laughs> uh, I know I'm going to be editing this. I'm going to end up with like 12 of these in my shopping cart. No, I mean, <laughs> it's, it, it's just one of those things. Oh, hey, I, we, we agree. I think it's a top notch product. Jeremy, thank you so much for bringing it up yeah, here. Then this thing's awesome. I would look. What's the cleanup like going to be on it? So, I was just, we were talking about that. Um, Honestly, it's it's just as easy as taking this off. That's like nails on a chalkboard. I love that. Um, oh, and also, there is two thirds left in this can. And if beer drinkers out there know, there's reason there's two thirds left in this can. Uh, with the physics machine, it keeps that two thirds down there because sometimes, if you get a cloudy IPA or you get a really big bold stout sometimes there's some sediment down there and you just kind of don't want that to run through one of these all the way so there's always just two-thirds left down in there just a little bit but you know what yeah. i ain't afraid I was gonna say, <laughs> this I is a great mind. beer so i don't mind we'll pour that I think it's good stuff can system and all right well until next time whether it be the beer you're running through your coffee maker the food you're eating or the physics that you're drinking out of. <laughs> ah, there you go. Grab a buddy. Try something. Oh, there I was going to say. There we Delicious. go. Delicious. <laughs> <laughs> See you.